YouTube. Que pasa? Welcome back to another Black Clover mobile video. Right, so today I do want to share with you some of my first hand experiences playing this game and actually one big annoying mistake I actually did in the beginning. Um, that mistake was so grievous that I was thinking even of rerolling my account but I couldn't be bothered because at that point when I realized that mistake I already had pretty good characters and yeah I, I thought I I'll leave it at that because anyways I'm waiting for the release of Global um, which should be dropping end of June mid July so it, it, I'm not really too bothered in all honesty if this account goes down the drain. Um, regardless, let me quickly show you. So what I'm talking about is when you start in the game of obviously you see these different rarities LR, UR and SSR, right? So whenever you want to get, let's say for instance this fashion uh, seasonal Yami, when, when you want to get him to SSR, you got to level him to level 60, right? That that would be the first thing you got to do, right? So you level him up, boom, when you, when you leveled him up, you also got to unlock these clover leaves, right? Now, and here is one thing a lot of people actually did, um, which is actually a grave mistake. Um, instead of using these, now you should only use these ones, the general ones where the clover is in the middle for this. Never ever use the ones where you have the face of a character in it. Don't ever do that mistake, like, please, for crying out loud, that is... Like, that is the mistake I'm talking about. And I unfortunately did that with Lotus, right? When it came to leveling this up, I actually, like an idiot who didn't know, who didn't know better, used these ones with the face in it. And yeah, what can I say? I kind of messed up in the long run since you get enough of these from each character from the bond or friendship affection. Uh, leveling up uh, to get your character to at least LR, right? And if you use them along the way for things like this, which you shouldn't be using them for, well, what can I say? That's basically a messed up character at the end. Like, now he's literally stuck at UR, and I can't level him up to LR unless I get one of these. And these are rare, like, literally rare. I was fortunate enough, well, where is it? to get one for um for a um sr character but um yeah what what can i say uh, it is <laughs> it is what it is now <laughs> it's basically i messed up my lotus but regardless i haven't messed up on any other characters so yeah i'm, I'm going on that part already got the current meta pvp team out there as well so i'm actually quite happy with, with the way the account is going um currently and by the way if, in case you didn't know these shards you can actually buy them from the shop right so when you head over to the shop and where is it um where is it right here um here is the shard exchange shop and you can buy these shards for instance you could use the shards as well to exchange for other items that's one thing you could do or you could use the shards to buy the cards for the for the seasonal characters Right, that's also one thing um, which is really, um, really good actually, because the drop rates aren't really too too good in all honesty, and you might be spending 4k or 5k of jewels and not get nothing, and that's why this actually comes in pretty handy. Like if you got the Yami actually getting his special card, would it be a bad choice? Or in my case, I would want to get probably I'm buying the card for William, right? Now. Anyways, um, here you can actually exchange uh, these shards, right? Here you can actually, for instance, here, use these shards to buy five of these SR shards are enough to get one of these SSR shards. And we're going to get one. And basically, that's how you're able to stack up on these kind of materials as well along the way, right? And I'd highly suggest always buying these silver ones and using the uh, general ones or the excess ones from from rare characters since rare characters actually uh, drop by pretty often like it's it's not it's nothing really that's going to get wasted right rare characters you get them probably most of your summons and they end up stacking their shards pretty fast so you're not going to lose out on that end but 
regardless i would always exchange these sr ones so you get enough sr ones and then i would use um some of them to even exchange for the golden ones since yeah wait, wait does this give one yeah you only use one unfortunately but I, I, that's the way i would play it and going into global version i already know what mistakes to avoid and what things to focus on and stuff so i literally i'm 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 hyped for global right um but i'm already um uh trying to go hard in into current pvp season here on this japanese version so yeah i do hope I could like help some of your newer players out there. So whenever you're trying to ascend, just remember never to use the shards of characters' faces in it for the unlocking of the four-leaf clover, since that is basically going to mess up the character in the long run. Unless we're talking about an SR character. I mean, with an SR character, you probably could get away since these are more common dropping from 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 summons and stuff but still i wouldn't do it um always use the general ones that way you're on a safer side and i do hope this video was helpful for some of you all out there thanks for watching don't forget to smash the like button take care of yourselves and until next time